Today, I'm going to show you how to create an Instagram photo in PowerPoint. Let's do this. So the first thing we're going to do is open up blank presentation and change the aspect ratio of the picture so it's a square. And we're going to do that changing the slide size and we're going to change it to 800 pixels by 800 pixels. Don't be alarmed when PowerPoint changes that measurement back into inches. It's still 800 pixels by 800 pixels. So once we've done that, then we're going to go in and we're going to change the layout and we're going to change it to a blank layout and that will get rid of all the text boxes and the images and anything that you have in the default slide. We're going to bring over an image uh, which I had stored in a folder. You can use the insert image feature as well. What we're going to do is we're going to arrange the picture keeping in mind that the left hand side is going to be our final product so I always refer to back to that just to see what the image is going to look like when I'm done. In this particular post we're going to have a little inspirational quote so I've added a text box uh, using the word art feature and we can go in and we can change the size of the text box, the font size, the, the font, the colors, you know, pretty much anything that you can do in a PowerPoint presentation, we can do with our text for our, our photo. One thing to keep in mind though, is when you're playing around with the size of it, refer back to that left-hand side just to make sure that it, it fits in our final image. So once we've played around with the, the colors and we've changed the text to a font type that we like. Um, so I'm just going to fast forward this a little bit. So once we're happy with our image, what we're going to do then is go up to file and we're going to export our image. And what we're going to do is save it as an image file rather than a PowerPoint presentation. We have a few different choices such as JPEG, a PNG, GIF. We're going to save it on a location on our desktop and then we can either share it through the desktop app for Instagram or we can upload it to the phone and then share it from the phone. So this is what the image looks like in Instagram on the phone. Hope you enjoyed my little PowerPoint hack for creating images for Instagram in PowerPoint. If you'd like to see more videos like this, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.